Big titty gang. Dive Studios when we filmed Fighting on Facebook. I'm back here. I am back here because Peniel, BM, and I are filming a podcast today. We had our first uh, test shoot last week and this is our second time. It's really exciting. I'm not really sure when it's gonna go up, but I will let you guys know. Oh, cool. hi. <laughs> hey, are you part of the Big Titty Gang? If you wanna be, can you be a part show. of it? Hell yeah! <laughs> Hell yeah! It's not about the size. It's huh. about the heart. Yeah. It's about the titty heart. <laughs> yeah. They make you do improv. Alright, I'm at radio now. We recorded three episodes, so that took quite a long time. But I'll keep you guys updated with the podcast stuff once I know more details. But please look forward to it. 8 30 a.m. and I woke up super early today because I'm going to get my hair done. A hairstylist from Overmars contacted me and asked me if I wanted to get my hair done and I knew about Overmars because a lot of rappers and like R&B artists here in Korea get their hair done there. They do like a lot of experimental hairstyles and uh, do a lot of like colorful hairstyles and I thought yeah why not I'm excited to see what color she thinks will look good on me she wanted to do something like like a greenish blue like a teal color I don't know we'll see I don't know how that's gonna look and I also want to get layers and cut my hair a bit I'm here I've never seen something like this before. How oh, they make this? They sell it like this? Whoa. They put on something that takes out the color of my hair to take out the purple that's kind of left in there. I'm gonna dye my hair this color. I'm kind of nervous about it. Basically, like this color. But I'm not gonna cut my hair like that. I'm just gonna keep it the way it is right now and I'm just gonna add some layers. I'm nervous but excited. I just wanna like try all the colors. They have snacks here. This is so cute. Happy Moo. It has smiley faces. Oh, this is Singaporean. I know this is gonna be good. Let me try it a little later. I'm gonna bleach my hair now. Getting the bleach out. Oh, I put purple shampoo and I have to lay here for 15 minutes. I feel like I'm gonna fall asleep because I'm so sleepy. Oh, my hair designer got me to keep fall. Yay! 
they got supreme chairs. Wow, I can't make you stay, but I just can't take the pain. You keep me guessing, but you're undressing. I see the brown hair fall off your shoulder. How am I supposed to move on when you call me? But I know you don't want I'm gonna be putting on a clear coat <laughs> to lock the colors in so it doesn't fade too quickly. See fake ass dudes all acting bitch. Like what the fuck is this? Yeah, thought you made a bid. Yeah, bought expensive shit. Now you returning all of it. And I kinda see myself in them. No, I gotta take a L sometimes. Hair getting pulled out by the stems. Just know I didn't cross no lines. See them when I close my eyes. Feel weird when a friend's nearby. Conversation really wastes my time. They styled it in the, you know, wet hair look with baby oil. So it's kind of oily, but wow. I'm at radio now and today is the day that I have um, recording for the weekend with Alex. So I'm going to try to get his reaction to my hair. Oh my God, my hair is so oily. So the sides of my hair are blue, which is a nice little touch to the overall green color. It's so vibrant. I can't get used to it. I feel like I'm wearing a wig. Right, let's see what his reaction is going to be like. Hi. Hi. Is it blue on the knee? Is it blue on the knee? Oh yeah, over on the side. <laughs> I did. I just did it. Just did it now. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> so I'm back at home now. It is 12:30 a.m. and I've got to start packing. I realized I didn't mention anything about my trip. But I'm going to Jeju tomorrow with four of my girlfriends. The reason why I started packing so late is because I had to finish up working on a vlog and I just uploaded it. So now I'm, yeah, I gotta start packing. I'll be gone for three nights and four days. So Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. And the downside of this trip is that it'll be raining three days out of the four days we're there. It is monsoon season right now and it's been raining in Seoul for like three days too. But yeah, so that's kind of like, so now I just kind of don't know what to pack. But I feel like this small carry-on bag will be enough for four days. Considering the fact that Joan's bringing like all the skincare so we don't have to pack any of that. Probably just like clothes and shoes and personal items. Let's get started with packing. I'm a horrible packer and I dread packing. I do not enjoy it at all. Oh wait, this is a lot smaller than I imagined. Okay, first of all, I have this jump fruit from Days Days that I've been saving to wear to Jeju-do. So I'm gonna pack this. But like the temperature isn't even that high. It's like mid 70s. I feel like it'll get really cold at night. Yay, one thing so far. What do I wear tomorrow is the question. It's actually not raining that much in Jeju tomorrow. So I should save the best outfit to, for tomorrow. And now also I have to take into the consideration that my hair is really colorful. So that's gonna get in the way of a lot of my outfits too, I feel like. I was saving this vintage dress to wear, but I feel like it's too much with my hair right now. I also wanted to wear this, but I feel like this is too much with my hair too. What do I do? Do I just wear it? Do I just rock it? Too much. Okay, I actually got a lot of packing done while I was charging my battery for my camera. So I decided for this trip, I'm only gonna wear like nude or white colors. 
just because I just don't know if I can wear any other color on top of this hair right now. I packed like my white romper, white linen pants, nude tank top, and that one day's day's jumpsuit you saw before. And tomorrow I'm just gonna be wearing my pants with my halter top. Also, I packed my probiotics, vitamins, and emergency for the five of us just because I feel like we're not gonna get a lot of sleep and I don't want us to get sick. I also packed another pair of sandals besides the Dr. Martin ones that I'm gonna be wearing. Um, I'm not gonna bring sneakers for this trip because I honestly don't think we're gonna be walking around too much. This whole trip is supposed to be like a healing trip for all of us and we decided that we weren't gonna do too much sightseeing. Just a lot of relaxing and eating good food. Hence the reason why I'm not bringing my sneakers. And I also need to bring up outerwear just in case it gets cold at night. I'm just gonna bring my black cardigan because you can never go wrong with a black cardigan. I think I'm gonna need to wear it on the plane tomorrow so I'm gonna set it aside for now. I feel like the rest are just like my chargers and my personal makeup stuff. Mm -hmm.